War 10 of Season 47 versus SGA, and I am bringing Kate, Crossbones, and Iron Man, and I'm pretty sure you already know what path I'm taking. So, I am using a PS1 for this Dragon Man. I was assigned an Invul, um, but knowing Kate, that doesn't really make a lot of sense, especially because Dragon Man's Special 3 doesn't hit that hard. So instead, I put on a 33% Special Boost and did a PS1, which is actually a lot safer. So, here we go. I am going to parry first to remove that power charge, and then special one. And yeah, you can see he's literally just going to start melting. 3.3k um, per tick. Heavy there. Gonna go ahead and block this. Then I can get up already to my second special, so that's the power of the PS1. Yeah, with, with non-hard-hitting special three champions, PS1 for Kate is just so outrageously gross. Um... And yeah, so the fight is down with literally no problem at all. And uh, yeah, definitely PS1 was the right call there. Um, then I have Danny here with Iron Man. I've never fought a Danny except an AQ once a month when I actually enter it. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm just going to hit her. And like, I'd probably not want to push her to SP2. Don't hit into her block when she has that falter thing. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all that I, all that I know, which I, I think is, is for the most part accurate, so, um, here I try to bait it a special, although admittedly I'm kind of turtly, so it's kind of, like, not really the best special baiting I've ever had. She seems very aggressive, it's because I don't really want to get caught by a dashback, so instead I'm like, you know what, I will push her to SP2. Hopefully this doesn't hit very hard. So I bait this thing out, she doesn't really want to go for it. I, I am blocking a little bit, I think her animations are just a little bit lungy for my liking. Bullets into block. Take that, and we are good to go, okay? Perfect. Intercept. And you can see my, my not my Furies, my armors are, like, kind of falling off. Just a little bit concerning. All right, there we go. Another special, okay. And we're finally in our damage mode, which is perfect. But uh, I also don't have any armor breaks up yet, which is a little bit annoying. Uh, gonna bait this out. Yeah, uh, this fight is just not fun to watch. Like, if I could just mentally skip this fight, I would. Uh, yeah, it's garbage. I don't play it well. The AI is not good, mostly because I don't play it well. Um, and yeah, just generally a slog of a fight. But once the damage comes, the damage comes. So she is gone. Uh, the last half of her health goes pretty quickly. And then we are on to section two, which has... Uh, what is this first fight? Is it Spider Ham or is that the next one? Oh, Havoc. Of course it's Havoc. So, Havoc and Spider-Ham, as usual, just wasn't sure the order. Um, and, I mean, I've taken this fight many times before. The game plan is as always. Um, yeah. Get the Steadfast up and uh, hit him. Bait out specials for the prowess, all that fun stuff. And I have the PS1 left over. Uh, actually, from that first fight, I, this is the third fight with the PS1, which is kind of funny. Uh... Let's see. Get parried straight off rip, which is always great. Just absolute genius plays for me there. Intercept, drop the special. Okay. I'm almost overrun. Uh, not overrun, sorry. Uh, that's crossbones. Uh, I'm almost an arc reactor. There we go. Now I'm an arc reactor and I have armor breaks, which means that my damage has lined up fairly good. Okay. And yeah, I'm hitting pretty darn hard here. Get a intercept into special one. Now I have six armor breaks. He throws that. Otherwise, honestly, could have combo relic combo. He'd probably be dead. How do I even like get hit there? Like I actually have no idea. Um, but I combo into relic, and he's gone. So uh, definitely could have played better, but very very safe counter there. Um, now I have Spider Ham. I want to make sure that my PS1 is not on because that would be a problem. I think I might invul for this. I'm not sure what I did, but I know my PS1 was definitely not on because that would be a big no no for Spider Ham. I do not want to Joe Ham. All right, here we go. Shrug that. Heal block, which is always nice. Combo. Two hits, special one. I don't really know what that slight pause was. I think I was considering going for intercept, and then I was like, that's actually stupid. Let's not do that. Um, so here I bait out the special heavy counter. Perfect. And I don't want a heavy counter here. And for once in my life, I actually watch the charges and don't do stupid stuff. That's lovely. And I'm probably going to lose my Furies here. Heavy. Um, so I keep it for now. Going to heavy counter this as well. Oh, nope. Just kidding. Uh, combo and he dies. So 
Uh, yeah, that was pretty straightforward. Probably the best Spider-Ham fight I've had in a while because I tend to play like garbage versus him. Um, then I have, is this Void? Yeah, so I think this is my last fight of the war. It's Void with Crossbones. It is on Hazard, and I do have a Wags because it is Conflictor. Now, normally with Conflictor, you do not want to throw a special two with Crossbones, but in this case, you actually can because Void is Incinerate Immune, and thus you will not be triggering that power gain. Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to ramp myself up with some of these debuffs. Hopefully, most of them get shrugged. Uh, it seems like one of them got shrugged, so that's, that's halfway there. Um, special one, and then Overrun. Oh my god, I am terrible at repairing. I honestly, at this point, haven't even really, like, done any repairies, just, like, in war. Like, I don't really repair it, I kind of just bait heavies, just because I feel like it's a little bit, uh, mindless. And, and I like mindless. <laughs> wow. Uh, I forgot about that, so I whiff a heavy counter, or not a heavy counter, a heavy, uh, chain in the corner, and I get absolutely rocked. Okay, heavy for the pause, then I need to overrun, refresh my Furies. Okay, special two, and then I need to get my pause off again, so please don't throw this special. Um, beautiful little light intercept there into relic so I can heavy. Okay. There. Block the first hit, dex the second. And again, my fears are about to fall off, but I dropped this special two anyway because it should be fine. Almost kills. I have the taunt and steadfast so I can just block this for safety. And, uh, that last 5% goes down without a problem. So yeah, definitely not a good fight and a pretty messy war, but, uh, we got it done and did it without dying, which is always preferable.